minutes. Oh, good morning, good morning everybody. That. We are getting Fresh, busy. Busy in the kitchen. Busy like a bee in the kitchen this morning. Chef Amy is in. We have chicken and waffles. Yes. Chipotle honey drizzle, a yes. lavender honey lemonade. Oh my gosh, you know it all. You are bringing it this morning, my girl. Oh, I love this. All yes. things fresh yes. and local, too, here in the kitchen with Chef Amy. I'm in the kitchen. George is in the green room. And you are looking at a live picture of Owlbert. He's a spectacled owl. He is here with Amazon John and Patty Spittler. We're going to be talking about how awesome owls are. I took a selfie with him earlier. You know what happens when you take a selfie with an owl? It's not a shoot. Randy, it's a hoot. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> Lots of puns yeah, are in store today. I think he's related to me. It's uh, part of the Owlis family. Randy mm -hmm. Owlis. Look what you guys Chef started. Chef Amy Owlis there. Look, so. look what you guys started. All right, guys, we'll come up. They are the voices behind some of the most beloved Disney characters. The actresses who voiced Meg and Hercules, Jasmine in Aladdin, and Belle and Beauty and the Beast are part of a major production in which they perform iconic Disney songs live. We're talking to Disney princesses this morning. Yeah, Randon, she's the activist who fought for justice in Hinkley, California, when the water was polluted by a large corporation. Aaron Brockovich is going to be joining us here today to talk about another danger, lead in our drinking water. All right. Big, big stuff happening today. Let's yep, get into this. Yeah, let's go on. Absolutely. Let's get into this question of the day, shall we? Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Yeah, our question of the day is brought to you by <laughs> Kitchen uh, Saver uh, Custom Cabinet Renewal. Uh, do you leave kitchen appliances on the counter or put them away after use? I, I put them in the kitchen sink. That's what I do. We just pile them up there and get <laughs> nice. taken care of. Nice. So, yeah. Mandy says, who takes appliances off the counter? I have always left them on the counter. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Hey, Susan says, just a few on the counter, the coffee maker, stand mixer, the rest are under the kitchen island. Oh, okay. okay. Got an item. Got an island. Oh. She fancy. Tammy says, I have very little counter space. I wrap them in a clear trash bag and store them downstairs <laughs> in my <laughs> basement. <laughs> Tammy's anti-dishes. Oh. That's what I gather from that. Wow. Oh, that's great stuff. And you said you said you just leave the stuff yeah, on the counter? There, yeah. Well, I, eventually I, it piles up with we'll thrown to the dishwasher. Mm, you know, we, eventually I, I, we'll get them clean. I put the stuff away. Um, yeah. There's only one person that probably does it exactly right. That's probably yeah. Amber. And probably, no. uh, oh, and then probably Chef Angel. Randy, yeah, I, <laughs> Randy, Randy real quick, are yeah. you thinking dishes or are you actually talking appliances until we clean yeah. them? Uh, dishes. Okay, so we're talking appliances like toaster, crock pot. Yeah. No, he puts, the, he puts the toaster in the dishwasher. I believe it. I believe it. No, I put it on the kitchen sink. Yeah. <laughs> and then your wife can pick it up. And yeah, yeah, that's it. <laughs> she can fix it. Look in the sink. She yeah. fixes it. Don't oh, judge him. Don't oh, judge him. Not, not Chef Amy. I, I, I do it entirely right, and that is I follow orders. Yes. I put Whatever stuff where Kathy I am tells told you, right? to put it. Exactly, yes. Yes. exactly. And you do? I do a half and half. Half and like, half, a little bit of both. Yeah, I have a big air fancy fryer, so I yeah. always do. I always have that on the counter. Yeah. And that does everything for me. Yeah. So. Well, there you go. Okay, okay. keep chiming in on that fryer. question of the day. All right, we're talking bees and honey this yes. morning. So I took a trip um, to a local uh, bee maker, and um, I wanted to infuse some recipes here at the, you know, the beginning yeah. of the show because yes, I yes. want to see you guys all get sticky throughout the show and have some fun and some sweetness. So let's start with our lavender lemonade. This lavender is a really, lemonade. really, really good recipe. Okay. For just like when it starts, get, remember it was 70 degrees on yeah. Saturday? It was gorgeous. And I love lemonade. 